Hey, ka, hey, ka, hey, ka, hi, everybody. I hope you're all having a good day. I hope you're all smiling and enjoying your lovely day. So in this following tutorial, I'm going to show you on how you can change the colors of your Vignan UI. So in case you don't know, Vignan has a brand new UI setup. And basically, you know, of course, you have to download a new version of Vignan for it. But basically, there's a much more um, fancier looking UI for Vignan. And not only that, we can actually have custom themes. So already on Vignan, yeah, we do have some example like pre-existing examples here as you can see so pretty much uh, you can choose the colors that you prefer um, that comes built in but what if you want to make your own so for my case I have pretty much um, like a black and blue sort of setup since I wanted like a dark theme mode but blue so that's basically my setup here and I'm gonna show you on how you can do that so on file explorer you should have a Vignan folder somewhere in your PC. It looks something like this, right? So basically what you're going to do is that under the themes folder, which is a new folder that Vignan has now, um, here this is where you're going to be able to create brand new themes for um, pretty much new themes for Vignan regarding the UI basically. So there's a readme. It basically explains pretty much how you can do it basically. So. Uh, let's say for instance, I want to copy from dark gray. Let's say that so we're going to do control C then control V and we're going to make a new JSON file um, And then pretty much what I'm going to do is I'm going to rename this however I want Let's say for instance, I want to make it a Green color so we'll call this green theme just an example or you could call it purple theme But we'll just do green theme. So we're gonna do that and then once you have that, you're going to double click on the file and you should have this that pops up. There should be, uh, you should have notepad or whatever, uh, you know, text related program you have. But basically on notepad, you're going to basically change the following. So start off by changing the theme name to whatever you want. Mine is green theme. And then basically these here are the hex colors uh, regarding each part of the UI basically. So let's say you know text, uh, you can make it into like semi gray or pink. Uh, icons referring to like the little picture for instance here. Uh, borders, whichever you want. It's mainly just uh, mess around with it. And the camera background, if you don't like the background here, you could change it. However you want, I would say experiment it basically. So I'm going to show you how I personally would do it. So let's start off. So I'm going to use GIMP real quick, um, real quickly, just so I can uh, at least get the colors. Um, you can also use a website. Um, you can use a website like color theory website. So that way you can actually pick out a color of your preference basically. But I'm just going to use my photo editing program just to just take out the hex code basically so um so basically right here let's say for instance i want to make the borders green so we're gonna put we're gonna control and you know paste it here so i i copied it from gimp and then i paste it there i'm going to let's say we're going to make um let's say we're going to make the internal and the inner borders let's say we're gonna make that one green as well and in case you're wondering like what it'll change so basically to see the effects happen in Vignan all you have to do is do control s in notepad you know after you change some colors and then just click on reload and then check around and see what part of Vignan it, it changes and for my case I accidentally forgot to change it so make sure you also change it too so right here green theme there you go now it works so as you can see now now you can see the green happening basically so um, there's that let's say we want to make the icons also green here reload there you go uh, let's say maybe that's a little too much for us maybe we want a lighter green so we'll do that control C um, and then let's say icon will be this save it and then reload just like that isn't that cool you can change the color however you want we can even have it where the background like I said just experiment it basically but this is pretty much just the sort of workflow regarding how you can do it basically and it's really cool. Uh, so if you know if you don't like the default colors, or maybe you want to have your own personalized one, then you can basically do that. Basically, so yeah. And um, 
of course you can uh, the benefit too as well uh now i will say by the way in case you're wondering about the notes the notes currently will eventually get their update they will have the sort of modern ui style that you know vinyan has here it's not ready yet of course but in the future this will get updated but in the meantime if you want to change your node color you can just right click and set colors and such but i just wanted to at least address that in case anyone's wondering why you can't um why the, why the nodes look a little different so yeah but either way though that's pretty much in a nutshell you just basically do that and you can even share it with other people of the community so basically if you want to share it um you can easily go to discord right here uh this is the this is suvi's discord server you could just go here and then i can say you know i could put it here and then say green theme basically so there you go um but pretty much in a nutshell though that's pretty much how you can change the color and the ui in vinyan basically go have you know have some fun basically because it's you know like you can have fun with the ui you know make it make it feel like it's your program so yeah uh have fun though i hope you guys have a lovely day and i'll see you guys next time bye bye